Hey guys, it's Fistola Coffee and today inside of this monster analysis video we're going to be going over Superfume and I'm going to be telling you guys whether or not you should get her out of her current conjuring event. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so if you guys didn't know, Superfume is a brand new monster that you can get while trying to get the new ancestor Justin Justice out of the conjuring. You can also get Superfume out of it. So yeah, she's a support and her traits are hardened at rank 0. And then a poison immunity at rank 1 and status caster team minor damage boost at rank 3. And then her relics are trap and essence which are both pretty great actually those are really good so now let's go on down to the pros and the cons all right so we have a great speed amazing relics nature and a magic meta great supporting and damage boost and control immunity which are both very very good she also can do extra turns with opium and joy she also has access to toxins and vulnerable which are both really great as well and then she has a low cooldowns and stamina costs which are of course amazing and then her cons are bad life, which honestly isn't that big a deal if you can get a tank to block for her, which you definitely should. And then useless trait except status caster, easily denied if she doesn't use justice fragrance, which gives team double damage and control immunity, which is kind of true. And then anticipation can be a big problem and no NER access, which is true. And now let's go on down to her moveset. So she has a team double damage with control immunity. She has an ally damage boost with an extra turn, which is pretty great. She also has a minor damage boost with a self extra turn, which is also pretty great. And then she has a 50 nature damage with toxins and vulnerable and daze, which is a really good move. And that only has one cooldown. And then she has an AoE uh, nature damage with toxins and vulnerable, which is also really good. So yeah, she has some really, really amazing moves right here. But she doesn't have very many good supporting moves really and she is a support she doesn't have NER at all and I don't think she has PER either which is kind of sad. But she does have some good damage boosts and stuff she probably will be really good for like bounty hunts. But besides bounty hunts I don't really see her being used that much. Just because she doesn't have NER or PER as a support. But yeah, you guys can let me know down in the comments what you guys think of this monster and her moves. She does have some pretty good moves, but yeah, no NER or PER. So I can't really see her being used that much as a support. But yeah, again, let me know down in the comments if you guys think differently. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Goodbye.